Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, my name is Tanek127, and welcome back to Tanek FPS. And guys, I don't know if I ever told y'all, but I'm a Dahlia main. Can you tell? A little bit? No? Uh, how about now? Still no? Now? Maybe? <laughs> well, what's going on guys welcome back to another video um to neck 127 here and like i said guys yeah i really am a dahlia main in rogue company now um i have tried you know messing around with a lot of other rogues and stuff like that i do have some ones that i like however um i have a lot of uh knucklehead friends who like um taking every new main i set my eyes on <laughs> i've tried getting scorch fail somebody took her Want a Kestrel? Fail. Somebody took her. Hell, I even gave up on getting a Duelist and went after Switchblade. Guess what? Somebody took her. <laughs> but it's all good. Love them anyway. And But um, one thing about being a Dahlia main is means I am in love with the objection. Her SMG. And thanks to the weapon mastery system, the whole main thing, I don't have to worry about anymore. Because I can use this SMG on multiple rogues that use SMGs. So I decided to go ahead and take this SMG to somebody very interesting. This lovely individual right here, Scorch. Now, if you don't know, Scorch has an amazing ability called Overheat. And what it does is it takes your gun and just turns it into a melt machine. Literally, you do extra damage and you do fire damage over time. It is such an amazing an amazing, um, an amazing, an amazing ability. So amazing that it's been nerfed several times. Honestly, I think Scorch's, um, a lot of her nerfs were a little unjustified. More so people, um, you know, not wanting to adapt. But that's a video and a topic for another day. But, um, that's just my personal opinion. Now, for the build I'm going to give you guys here. Here are some of the perks you want to run. I'm going to name them all one by one. These are the ones I recommend so you get the most out of your money in an average game. Evade. Tenacity, Headstrong, and Replenish. You know, Nimble Hands and everything is good for weapon swap and reload speed, but come on, you're using the SMG. They don't take too long to reload anyway. And I mean, Berserker, if you want to reload while you're sprinting, you can, but I usually reload while in cover because, you know, it is a third-person shooter. It is very heavily cover-based. <laughs> I mean, you have the option to roll and stuff like that, but it is cover-based overall. But yeah, guys, like I was saying, I will let you know why I think you should just go with those four perks here in a second. Because we're going to go ahead and talk about the weapon. Now, the weapon objection, like all weapons in Rogue Company, it has four tiers. As you guys can see, it's pretty low in body damage, pretty low in range. has a decent mag size. Reload time's pretty quick, which is why I told you you guys wouldn't need the perk for, for the reload time. has a very high fire rate and really good accuracy in handling. And... A lot of these stats are just going to go up as you go up in tiers. Now, me personally, I would recommend um, going all the way up to tier 4. But as you guys can see, in tier 2, the handling alone goes up 4 points. The reload time gets even shorter. Once again, why you wouldn't need to, why you wouldn't really need Berserk. And then, even at the final tier, the range even increases by 3 points. So, meaning it gets better range and better handling. And this is a high fire, high accuracy weapon, meaning it is a beam. So this plus Scorch's ultimate, mwah, magnifique, tasty, as you guys seen in the intro clips. But you guys get what I'm saying. And that wasn't even a tier four version of this weapon. So trust me, guys, this is a build that you do not want to miss out on. It is an amazing an amazing build. I love this weapon. Um, honestly, I would recommend using the objection with a lot of rogues. It's just a, it's a very accurate weapon. You know, if you're a person who goes for a lot of headshots and stuff like that, try this. I'm telling you. But anyway, guys, y'all enjoyed this video and it helped you. Let me know by leaving a comment, thumbs up on the video. Subscribe here if you're new and want more rogue company content. I will see y'all in the next one. Peace out. Have a good one.